Facial microdermabrasion, this is what you should know. Facial microdermabrasion is a procedure to treat and rejuvenate facial skin. This procedure is carried out using exfoliation techniques so that dead skin cells on the face can be removed. Facial microdermabrasion is usually done to treat a number of problems on the surface or outer layer, epidermis, of facial skin, such as reducing fine wrinkles, reducing age spots, and making skin look healthier. This procedure is not effective for deep scars on the face. Unlike dermabrasion which requires local or general anesthesia, the facial microdermabrasion procedure does not use anesthetic because it is painless. Purpose and Indications of Facial Microdermabrasion Facial microdermabrasion is generally performed on people who have the following facial skin problems. Fine lines or wrinkles acne or acne scars dull skin blackheads and large pores unequal skin color black spots uneven skin texture hyperpigmentation namely dark patches on the skin around the face warnings and contraindications to facial microdermabrasion facial microdermabrasion cannot be performed on people with the following conditions just had facial surgery within the previous two months are undergoing radiotherapy to the face or head are taking or have ever taken isotretinoin in the past six months have abnormalities in facial skin that are suspected of being skin cancer suffering from open sores or infections on the face and around the mouth such as herpes warts or impetigo Suffering from allergies to materials used in microdermabrasion procedures, such as aluminum. Have raised scars or scar tissue, keloids. Apart from not being able to be performed on people with the conditions above, this procedure is also not recommended for people with rosacea, cystic acne, or telangiectasia. Before facial microdermabrasion. Before performing facial microdermabrasion, the doctor will examine the patient's condition to ensure that this procedure is safe and suitable for the patient's facial skin problems. Patients also need to do the following before undergoing facial microdermabrasion. Tell your doctor if you have an allergy to certain facial care products. Avoid sun exposure for at least one week before the procedure. Do not do waxing or other actions to remove facial hair for one week before the procedure. Stop using sunscreen creams, exfoliating creams, and facial masks for three days before the procedure. Cleaning the face and not using cosmetics on the face before undergoing the procedure. Facial microdermabrasion procedure. Facial microdermabrasion can be done in a beauty clinic or hospital. This procedure generally takes about 30 to 60 minutes. Although it can be uncomfortable, facial microdermabrasion does not require local or general anesthesia. There are three types of facial microdermabrasion that doctors can perform, namely crystal microdermabrasion, diamond tip handpiece, and hydrodermabrasion. Here is the explanation. 1. Crystal microdermabrasion Crystal microdermabrasion is a type of facial microdermabrasion that is performed by spraying small crystals onto the outermost layer of facial skin, epidermis. The crystal grains will erode and remove dead skin cells so that they can stimulate the growth of new skin cells. 2. Diamond-tipped handpiece A diamond-tipped handpiece is a type of treatment that is performed using a stick-like instrument. The tip of this tool contains small crystals. When rubbed into facial skin, dead skin cells will be exfoliated and sucked up by the tool. 
The depth of the skin that is peeled off depends on the tool rubbed and how long the vacuuming is done. This tool is generally used on areas of the face that are hard to reach and sensitive, such as the skin around the eyes. 3. Hydrodermabrasion Hydrodermabrasion is done by combining the use of a crystal-free exfoliant with a special liquid that can make facial skin cleaner and moisturized. Hydrodermabrasion is useful for removing dead skin, improving blood flow to facial skin, and increasing collagen production which is good for facial skin health. The doctor may advise the patient to undergo follow-up sessions to get the best results. Generally, it takes 5 to 16 sessions of facial microdermabrasion to achieve smoother, more radiant skin. After facial microdermabrasion, after undergoing facial microdermabrasion, patients may go home and continue their normal activities. For several weeks, patients may feel their skin is more sensitive than usual, especially when exposed to sunlight or exposed to certain skincare products. Therefore, Patients are strongly advised to use sunscreen if they want to do outdoor activities during the day. Choose and use care products that moisturize facial skin, and avoid using acne remover drugs after undergoing this procedure. Complications or Side Effects of Facial Microdermabrasion Facial microdermabrasion is a safe procedure and rarely causes serious side effects. Complaints usually only arise on the outer surface of the skin, epidermis, and do not last long. Some of these side effects are Skin tightens Redness Swollen Bruises Sensitive skin Dry skin Peeling skin